Unlimited for two minutes. Audio description introduction. An interview with Becky Perriman talking about her sound installation, The Doorways Project. The shot shows a speaker in an underground location from which homeless people's voices are broadcast. Unlimited. Two minutes with Becky Perriman and her sound installation, The Doorways Project. Um, it's a site-specific touring piece about homeless culture. And the purpose of the project is to give homeless people a voice and a kind of voice that they don't usually have. So it's about their everyday experience, um, like what it's actually like to live on the streets. And even though I've got my own personal experience of homelessness, like I'm more interested in giving other people a voice I think people sleep on the beach um, because there's a natural alarm factor there as well. When, in the dead of night when you're asleep on the beach, you hear everything. So anyone that walks in, make pebble sounds. You know, so, so, so you, you, you start to think along very simple basics like that of how to safeguard yourself. And, and that was the primary motivator for me, how to safeguard myself. And I don't think like most people, unless they've experienced it, they don't know what their everyday experience is like of being homeless. So that's what the project is about. Overexposure literally riddles you. You've got no idea until you do it. People kind of view weather like, like, like that's the main reason behind overexposure, but it's not. It's just being outside and again, having no mental safety net. Um, so in installing the work, I was looking for spaces that in some way replicate sleeping spaces. I want to reach like an accidental audience, so people who are walking past, who would never usually stop and listen to the homeless. Um, I'd like audiences just to actually listen to somebody's story. You know, when you're talking homelessness, you have no safety net, so you're constantly overexposed. So your, your thought patterns change and it changes to one of survival rather than one of trying to facilitate yourself in housing and employment, which is virtually impossible when you're at that state. Full credits at www.weareunlimited.org.uk Directed by David Heavey